I am actually right and we'll be covering today the green crowd shape of puppy set on the ground. Uh, we'll be bring we'll be bringing the strikes along this time who you may recognise from doing the Mega Garen or from being one the the technical officer for in the do on the last year's uh, round uh, kits to bring home and because I've got round kits to bring home which is the reason why I've see had all the kits from last year is the reason why I've got to reviewed it on this character I'll explain why later first I'm going to cover where we get it now here it is here we are in Q winter one blonde here's Q here's you come in you come in around here now you will start to get to leave as well, so you and in this this ring down here, you may not be able to spot him. You is a genius. Epos, cuddly and friendly so. Epos. Yeah. You might recognise you. You stand between the tables. You will find him here. <laughs> so he gives us loads of items. That's dash. Yeah, I know. Yeah. The items he'll be giving you will be within the ground equipment. Now remember, the, the, uh, this is a... And you can pick up some of your printing manuals and base other stuff. I'm bringing this one with me just so I can show it off later. But, you see four pieces of them, Peace and they all take... Is good for Business. 15 of each item, that's 15 target earmuffs, 15 boiling candles, 15 town holiday elements, 15 Vulcan meditation instances. Now these will only drop during the this, this winter event, so however you can use your duty officers to collect them. I have not, I've not got them ready to pick up at the moment so but you'll collect them or you could use whatever items you whatever snowballs you pick up to fight in the various fights in tide of ice and of um, run these races and stuff these because this is going to be one of the hardest things to get but you get your but you would you you just have to help you get the as much as you can. Way. If you can't, if you want to get it a lot quicker and have a have a nice easy collection, Q down here usually is on the table. Uh, Cam is got access to the exchange, and I also point out that this means you may be able to add, get hold of these uh, outside of the event, winter event. Oh. Oh. I made a mistake there. Tag for emails. <laughs> oh. Boom. And you can't. And this price is due in the event, so the prices will be very, 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 very low at the time of recording. However, you can buy them. Well, uh, uh, you can get a nice collection for. Five. Peace is good for <laughs> At this moment of time, this is the lowest you'll get. Those prices you'll be able to get per item, which is very, very nice for a vote for you at the moment. I should also point out, you can be able to buy these any time of the season, but you may not be able to get hold of the red star due to the fact that it's which is here. And you can access access everything in the window to vet start from the from your journal, which is that that button there, and second tab along events, and then event star. And if you have to have some event stuff still around, you can. A wise man can hear profit from, cut stuff from in there, a but I'm not gonna, we're not going to need to cover that here. So now you only need. Well, you only need sixty of these uh, 
these, to these tokens to get collect all of them. Is you might want to also collect various other items from the various various event stuff. So, so if I peace is good for business. So I have we can't show off the item here. We need to go find someone else. And I do want to point out we're going for various other places but as well. So let's go find another place to, to fight. Welcome to the Def Defire Invasion Zone. This is, is a very nice place to collect, uh, I call free cheaper Omega Max, but as you see, I've got <laughs> almost eight, over 800 of them. I don't need to collect too many more, but it's also a lot, a lot easier and quicker to keep ahead of the head of the game here. So, let's quickly cover some basic stats now that we're in a battle zone. So, the, the green cryo ship of universal kit frame gives kit ridges and kit performance, which means that it improves your kits a lot and it also talks about uh, anything that you have put any as a that has a cold kit module which shuts the which is all but one of the ones I've currently got equipped it's very nice to have we've also got the fringe cryo ship armor which is pretty nice at the moment. Uh, which has okay resistances and increases our willpower, which lets us do more survive a bit better. Uh, uh, and we also have a unique, somewhat unique ability called Cryo Bio Potential. Now, here it is. It will basically it provides you with temporary health, which is better for survival as you deal cold damage. And since you'll be more likely to be running a a the green cryo ship pistol or any of the green other gear, you can get a lot more take a lot more take a lot more damage. Have I've not have a, this area is more do target doing testing than actual fighting <laughs> and, and taking hits but you can take hits here not that much now again this is a is a, is a shield with a regeneration times three which means you get a lot more things and I think it, it talks about getting like choir blast stuff as well that might be pull blast which this is just pure because I think I've got other stuff in this, this. and here's and the weapon we find your normal we fire your primary fire you have a you have a ten percent chance to apply a polar blast to a target and knocks out ten in those ten percent of shields and do quite a bit of damage and that's pretty much all things normally we need to cover other than this is a set, so let's cover the set part. Because um, this item is actually infinite as you pick it up, this is currently set to level 50. Uh, level 50 equivalents. So this is actually doing less damage than it should do if I was to immediately upgrade it. So, what well, this to give you an idea of how it would do against somewhat decent enemies. <laughs> so, yep. yeah, I forgot to mention that directed blizzard will c apply pull blast to the tag directly to the two, three targets, but well, five targets around the ahead of you, and your your third ability is. Jab, which basically is the melee attack. First, if you get two pet sets of the bonus, you get 50% to 
from query value plus color plus five seconds it's and you increase the rate that the polar blast will slow down enemies and, and increase the chance to spawn another polar blast. Three sets dealing cold damage to a foe reduces its cold resistance by 15 which means you can do more damage and uh, and the, the the and the pistol which you picked up will the green Green question with Fern and Pistol, which is this, this part of this set. The. will gain. Uh, 100%. will gain doubles. increase. reloads. reload speed. when you get four piece sets. So, let's quite a quick. show off what, what some of the good news and some bad news about this. So. let's go and. That is quite a blast. Yeah, showing it. And here comes the first big pun. Whilst the enemies couldn't go quite of it. Just being frozen to death. With the AoE attack of happened with it. The first big problem you might have seen is that this weapon's is remodulating. And it is mod and it is affected cold abilities. Cold, so well, you can always use other abilities such as this grenade from the, from the tactical officer. And, and you can get even more abilities spinning up. And this one's company under attack and being shot pieces by this one. Very nice to take them out. So So now I'm gonna need to get myself into a new by an enemy that will come for me and I won't die immediately. <laughs> Couldn't it be bothered to attack me? So, let's go and find our tactical drone here. So th these two tactical drones are going to be attacking. And I'm getting... Whilst he took... Whilst you saw I died there, I would have died a lot quicker if it wasn't for the fact that I was doing freezing damage and getting my health back every so often. Well, I need to explain something which, which you may have missed there, because well, I wasn't pointing it out in the uh, in the with the actual video. But how did the green crashship cry by potential just work? It adds temporary HP in addition to your actual HP. Which is shown by the HP bar, as you can see in the bottom of the uh, bottom image of the screen. screen. This is not a heal. Your actual HP value is the same value as before, unless it's unless you got regenerated some of a heal going on at the same time. This, however, can buy you some time to survive because this temporary HP is often removed before for your own for your actual HP. Uh, this, the top image was taken five seconds after the cry barrier potential was activated, and the bottom second was three seconds after activating it. And yes, you, I've got slightly more hi hi effective XP at the time. At the time, However, just because I was to take some uh, extra hits, I wasn't doing putting out enough damage to take out the enemies and bring my hit and healing off the damage and I just basically was too busy showing it off than actually trying to survive so yeah back to me showing some more things up now this seems as well with basically only other 
with running around getting kit doing kit damage with the various stuff and the bark aren't the best play things to use it against. Oh. Well <laughs> That's the right thing. So let's show. So that's the right me taking damage and oof, I've gone up, probably gone up slightly, but well, frozen damage that, that fails. Very nice. Yes. I accidentally hit the team because of the area attack. But yes, this is a very, very tricky one to get good. good. It's what I call a nice a slow heat slow down enemy slow down one, which like what's the other? And not a. Because it's great, those dealers so at least. We'll hold him, we'll hold down any areas down for a little while because they won't be able to attack you. And but you do need to have a grab all of us some of these uh, kits but the thing is the kits themselves are going to be 15 each of each uh, each piece as well so that's not impossible to not I wouldn't dare. Is the group that I'm going to show you is going to be a bit tricky to do, but they will definitely fight me in a second. Oh, he's right. I get get out of that one. Because I frozen. I use kit bundles. Final thoughts, I really do need to have some final thoughts. Now the free feeling, so hull is pretty nice. So it does lots of lots about holes, downs over times and slows are pretty expected with the freezing and cold uh, expected. Well cold damage is rare in the game, very few enemies will resist it completely. The extra HP click here power is a decent survivor power, but it's not the it's not the super powerful clicky power it could could be. It is not immune to bug adaptation as you can start see. Up. It's got lower damage when you fire it, when you fire it, fire the weapon, but you do have it, the advantage of having the full set being boosting up your amount of shots you can fire. It also requires other event items to take a full advantage of. And I'm and I'm doing some research and I'm finding that some of the some of the better items don't come from the winter event but from the summer event as well. And I hate to say it, there are better slotting items better in slot best in slot better items in the in this slot in your shield armor and weapon slots that are available for free so it is not particularly not particularly brilliant now the big question is is it worth it now I'm going to say during Christmas yes but otherwise the cost to actually 
buy the actual components, the actual gear. Not really. Do next Christmas, you're going to get a great Christmas event. You're going to have a lot of items. Items. You're going to have a lot. You're going to get get the white items pretty quickly, especially if you went to farm it, farm it for like a while during the Christmas event. Anyway, this has been Mike Shoutwriter. See you guys next time.